Yo YouTube, what's going on? It's your boy Remix here bringing you guys another video today. The topic of discussion is quickscoping in Black Ops 3 and how it has changed. And let me tell you, it has changed greatly if you haven't noticed. When I first picked up the sniper rifle and I tried to quickscope, I couldn't connect to pick up a kill to save my life. I didn't exactly know why, however I think I've got an answer here. In previous titles, when you activated the L trigger, your rotational speed was fixed as if you were down scope immediately. However, in Black Ops 3, your rotational speed is not fixed at that rate until you are entirely scoped in. So the four tenths of a second it takes to aim down sights with the sniper rifle, you are moving with the speed as if you're just standing still spinning in a circle. And let me tell you, it covers much more ground that way. So what I did here was I opened up Call of Duty Advanced Warfare, went into a private match and I hopped up here on Terrace and decided, hey, let's give it a go. Now, when I hit my L trigger and pin my right stick to the left, I took a screenshot at the beginning and I took a screenshot at the end. I hopped on over to Photoshop and I came up with this. We covered about 27 degrees, plus or minus one, in the time it took us to aim down sights. Then I went on over to Black Ops 3 and executed the same action, and what do you know, all of a sudden we are over 70 degrees ground covered. I don't know if they plan on keeping this mechanic in the game, I'd like to see it go, but I hope you guys are enjoying the beta so far. If you're thinking this mechanic should be tossed, be sure to like and share this video, it's always best to spread awareness. I hope you guys enjoyed it, you know the drill. If you like it, like it. If you love it, subscribe. If you've got something to say, let me know in the comments below. As always, this has been your boy Remix. Peace out. Contact.